This is an example of the setup I have with the computer and a separate camera plugged in above it. It's a high resolution camera, wider angle, um, different color scheme than, than the built-in camera on my computer. It gives you some sense of what the video looks like when I'm doing this. You'll also notice that the picture of me is blended into the screen, um, but also obliterating part of that upper right corner of the image. And I have to take that into account as I design the slide. So there's actually room for my, my talking head. And now I've switched over to the camera that's built into the laptop, still using the same built-in microphone. Um, but you can see my head's a little bit lower or I'm having to tip my head down. The video is coming from a little bit below and you can decide for yourself which is better. You'll also notice the coloring is a little better because or a little different because the cameras have different color sensitivities even though they're spaced uh, probably 10, 12 centimeters apart right now. What you'll see now and here now hopefully is a little different because now I've switched to the geeky looking headset and that should pick up the sound a little better because I have a microphone right next to me. And where you should really notice that is when I turn my head, the microphone and the sound will still pick up the same quality of sound. Whereas if I turn my head on a microphone built into the computer, then the volume of course will go up and down. The sound quality will typically deteriorate as I turn away from the actual microphone. And it's important that you know where your microphone is in your computer if you're gonna be using that rather than something built in like this. I put this on and I can forget about it completely and just get on with, with the talk. You'll notice I've also moved the heading or the content of the slide down in order to make space for my face in the, the actual recorded presentation, something that you can only really do by trial and error. Now we're gonna try a third audio option. So you can't see it here because my hair covers it, but if you look carefully, you can see I have my Bose SoundSport connected. These are pretty typical Bluetooth headphones you probably have yourself in some version. Um, this is a relatively high-end one, um, has certainly good sound qualities and we'll see, maybe good microphone qualities. The microphone is somewhere hidden in the headphones. So it's good to know where that is before you start. You can experiment with that yourself. Usually it's in the controls um, of the headphones. So it's sort of hanging down, it's not stuck right in your ear. And so the sound pickup should be reasonably good. And again, these are high-end devices, so we'll see how it turns out. Okay, one more test, this time with a fairly low end, again, Bluetooth headset, same deal as before, the microphone is hanging somewhere in the controls and the cable. And uh, we can see if the headset that's probably less than half the price of the Bose SoundSport um, really shows a significant difference in the sound quality that you pick up. The listening sound quality is certainly quite different. That's, that's definitely very noticeable. But uh, it'll be interesting to see if you hear any difference as you're listening to this. Now we'll do a short video where we actually compare cameras. Um, this is now lower light than you saw me earlier today. The sun's going down, so it's a bit muted light. Um, and we can see how it, how it looks if we switch from what is now one camera to another camera. And I'll leave you to actually guess which one is which and look for the resolution, obviously the coloring, those sorts of things are different. Let's go back to the first camera again and, uh, and maybe you can guess which one you actually think it is. So this time I switched to a whole different configuration. I'm not even sure if you can see my face. I can't see my face at this point. But I am using the built-in headphones of a typical Apple iOS device, iPhone, iPad, and uh, you can judge for yourself what the sound quality is like um, in this kind of recording situation. <laughs> 